Grace be unto you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. The 16th of August, Wednesday of the week of Pentecost 11. Charles Wesley, 1707-1788, from a hymn, Ye Servants of God. Ye servants of God, your master proclaim and publish abroad his wonderful name, the name all victorious of Jesus extol, his kingdom is glorious and rules over all. The waves of the sea have lift up their voice, sore troubled that we in Jesus rejoice, the floods they are roaring, but Jesus is here, while we are adoring, he is always near. Men, devils, engage, the billows arise, and horrible rage and threaten the skies, their fury shall never our steadfastness shock. The weakest believer is built on a rock. God ruleth on high, almighty to save, and still he is nigh, his presence we have, the great congregation, his triumph shall sing, ascribing salvation to Jesus, our King. Salvation to God, who sits on the throne, let all cry aloud and honor the Son, our Jesus praises, the angels proclaim, fall down on their faces and worship the Lamb. Then, let us adore and give him his right, all glory and power and wisdom and might, all honor and blessing with angels above, and thanks never ceasing and infinite love. And the prayer. Augustine, Bishop of Hippo, 354-430. Blessed are all your saints, O God and King, who have traveled over the tempestuous sea of this mortal life and have made the harbor of peace and happiness. Watch over us who are still in our dangerous voyage and remember such as lie exposed to the rough storms of trouble and temptations. Fail is our vessel and the ocean is wide, but as in your mercy you have set our course, so steer the vessel of our life toward the everlasting shore of peace. Bring us at length to the quiet haven of our heart's desire, where you, O our God, are blessed and live and reign forever and ever. Amen.